Hello the kids, it is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of New Vegas. Alright, and when we left off, we were, uh, not here currently. We were, uh, trying to deal with stuff at Camp McCarran. I did that, took me 24, 25 minutes to get all of that done, come back to the sink to drop off some of the stuff we got from there, and then, now we're back here, picking up some stuff and dropping off the, uh, cartons of cigarettes that we've got, because... We've got our complimentary voucher already. Those things stack, by the way. If we're not in on time, they'll stack on each other. So there's that. But, as it stands currently, we have the voucher to get us a few thousand more chips. <laughs> which we really don't necessarily need at this point. I can drop off the uh, cigarettes ca cartons that I really don't need. The uh, cigarette packs that I really don't need for more caps that, again, we really don't necessarily need, but hey, if we have the ability, we might as well do it. So, uh, that said, there's a spring outfit that I can give up. There we are. Maybe there's some uh, casual wear that we can give up. There we go. And that's it. We've got all the caps that we can possibly get out of here, and let me just look and see what I can buy, because I might as well look through what I can get with the vast majority of chips that I now have. Uh, now that I'm just swimming in them, <laughs> uh, let's see. Do I really need more medics? I might as well get some more. Not like a shit ton, just like 50. That should be fine. Um, don't really need more magnum rounds. That's one of the few things that I don't need out of everything here. The rest of it is also food, but that I can get really much from cooking and whatnot. So, yeah, that's not really necessary at this point. Uh, we got Mentats, Radex, which is useful, but not necessarily something I run out of a lot. And then we got stim packs, which are always, 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 always useful. But, uh, yeah, as it stands right now, we're just going to sit on these for the time being, because the next DLC that we go into will allow us to get out of the area and come back to the Mojave Wasteland, should we need to. And believe me, we will need to, <laughs> because there's a lot of shit there that we will want. Now, uh, as you can see, I've been running around with a little bit more ammo than I did before. Uh, if I can get to the right tab, there we go. We have a respectable amount, about 1300 rounds for the 12.7. Uh, 318 for the 4570, uh, 700 for the uh, 45. I didn't think we need that much, but I figured we might as well carry that much. And then ammo that we're going to give to cast later. So, speaking of which, we should head to the strip. Uh, eventually, once we get to the right area, there it is. Uh, New Vegas Seal, no. We need to go to, no, no, up here. There we go. <laughs> when I can eventually find the correct spot, we can go to it. We gotta head to the Lucky 38 and uh, pick up our companions for the time being. Which one of them is uh, Eddie, which we we're going to be having around with us for a little while. I am, uh, my dehydration is really high up. I would have figured it would be lowered by now with that uh, sip from the canteen, but apparently not. Where is my water? There it is. Good stuff. Alright, good shit. Enter the strip. Alright. And yes, we have gotten rid of all the gold bars. That's why our weight was so low when you last looked. I pointed out here a 284. That is actually lower than I last saw it. <laughs> so that is impressive to say the least. But that said, we got a get into the lucky 38 to get our companions, but I want to see if Yes Man is outside of the Tops Casino now or not. Do I? No. He's not outside. I'm pretty sure I have to kill him, don't I? I'm pretty sure I have to kill him. Who's this guy? He's dressed up like the, uh... Oh, he's a Tops promoter. Okay. Okay, okay. I was about to flip because I thought he was uh, one of the other of uh, Frumentari from Kaisar, but I'm pretty sure I killed that guy before. 
I don't want to go all the way through the tops to get to... Yes, man. Is there a way to get him out? Do I have to bust the unit he's in? Be able to get him outside? Is that what I have to do? Well, those lights are uh, moving a little bit more than they really should. You see that? Yeah, I, I'm pretty sure they're not supposed to move like that. <laughs> anyway, uh, we're going to go in now. There we go. Huh, boy, oh boy. <laughs> I have no idea what I am doing <laughs> at this point now. i got a couple of these guys flanking me. Gentlemen, we're going to head up to the uh, presidential suite. I'm pretty sure that's the uh, place I'm supposed to go. Yeah, there we go. There's where my people are. Where's my Eddie? I can hear him. I can hear him. There he is. Hey, Eddie. Hey, buddy. Let's begin the companion protocol, the enhanced sensors perk. I didn't really look at that. I might as well look at that. Um, data. Nope, it'd be in stats under perks. Uh, there's enhanced sensors. There we go. While Eddie is a companion, the player can detect enemies at an increased range. Additionally, enemies will appear on the player's compass and can be targeted in bats even when cloaked. That is nice. That is nice to have. Where is my cast? Where's my girl? Where's my girl? Uh, there's, a, there's this here. Uh, turns out I wasn't able to get everything for Cass's moonshine, which is fine. Uh, where is Cass? Cass? Girl? Lady, where did you run off to? Are you over here? Over here in this room? There you are. You're sleeping on the bed. God. Girl. Come on now. Well, now, look what rolled in. Yeah. What, you getting lonely out there? A little bit, kind of, yeah. Who asked you? you? Looking to join up with me again? Was reminded why I left this place soon as I walked in. Let's go. Well, I mean, you didn't really start here, but okay, that line works fine. All right, um, let's... Let's deal. Yeah, let's give you some of the stuff that I have, which is a lot more ammo for you. There we are, and we're good. We're good, really. Uh, yeah, I picked up a couple of those because I ran into some powder gangers on my uh, way to uh, getting out uh, into the sink, and that's what happened. So, there we go. Uh, we go uh, to the casino floor, and then we just get out of here. There we go. Glad and then we... Yeah, I don't blame you. I don't blame you at all. Actually, I should talk to her a couple of times. Because I still have uh, stuff I need to talk to her about, I think. Maybe. Hopefully. Okay, Cass. Uh, let's talk a little bit. Inside the Lucky 38? I'm not sure whether that's a blessing or a curse. A bit of both. Probably a bit of both. Ask Other questions. Then. Uh, can you tell me anything about this platinum chip? Well, no idea why your friend Mr. House wants it. But I'm guessing it's not for the caps. Probably not. He's also dead, in case you forgot. Ask him then. Just, uh, just in case you forgot. Uh, everything else I already got. I think I already asked her about how she got started in the caravan business, didn't I? Or what she thinks of the NCR and the Legion? I could have sworn I talked to her about that stuff already. You make me some of your moonshine. Don't have all the ingredients you need. Come back when you have them, and yeah. I'd be happy to get something cooking. Fair enough. Uh, I need two mute fruits. I only have one, and I have everything else as it stands. So, yeah, I'll just all right then move on. I'm pretty sure I talked with her about all that stuff already. I could swear I did, unless I'm losing my mind, which is also very entirely possible. Okay, well that out of the way. Let's actually do the thing involving Eddie, and go to the Gibson Scrapyard, which is all the way down here. Thank you for that quest marker. That points me in the right direction because. Fuck! <laughs> I would not be able to find it otherwise at this rate. Oh, and there was a thing I wanted to do in the quarry eventually. Because I think we might be able to handle it. Maybe. Hey! Miss Gibson! Old Lady Gibson. So, you're back! Now, where did we leave off? That's a good question. Uh, Why do they call you Old Lady Gibson? That's not something I need to know. What do you know about Helios 1? The way I heard it... The Brotherhood of Steel ran the place before the NCR took it away from them. Huh. I'm not sure who Unclave started long shooting data first. Stored. But when it was huh. over, the Brotherhood, with all their fancy armor and weapons, was on the run. Nobody's heard from them since. Alrighty. Take care now. And wait for Subject it. Subject E, 
Diagnosis complete. Begin recording. My name is Whitley. I'm a researcher at Adams Air Force Base. Until recently, I was in charge of the Duraframe reinforcement project for the combat model iBots. Uh, continue. iBot Duraframe Subject E is both the prototype and the last functional model in this test group. I was prepared to make several significant upgrades to the machines. However, as the project was cancelled and all Duraframe assets are being diverted to Hellfire Armor, I am sending this model to the Navarro Outpost. If you're listening to this log from one of our Enclave outposts in Chicago, give this unit whatever repairs it needs so it can continue to Navarro. Alrighty. That's new. So, uh, let's talk to him. Uh... Don't, we can't really talk about much else other than the log one playback. Let's continue. Uh, continue. All right, that's it. That's all we know out of. Um, there's an enemy over there. Uh, not that we can see. I guess that's uh, pinged because of the enhanced sensors perk. Um, so we've learned that he apparently was one of the Enclave iBots, which if you play Fallout 3, that's how you would know that he's probably Enclave. Um, I'll, I'm not going to spoil much about that game because, you know, a lot of that does play into here, but not a lot. Uh, mainly the game engine. <laughs> um, yeah, he is a part of the Enclave that is more or less, you know, out there still. And, um, that's about it. Apparently he was trying to head out to the Navarro outpost and got dinged a lot along the way. So, uh, yeah. We'll eventually need to find other places where keywords will trigger, you know, playback logs for Eddie, but those are not really pointed at a lot in game. So, apparently it's some... Uh, I could look it up and eventually do it that way, but I kind of don't want to <laughs> at the same time. But we will eventually learn a little more about Eddie in the next DLC. So, there's that. Um... I should probably deal with that uh, food status. How, how bad is my food? Um, H2O is 86, and food is 209. Ooh. Yeesh. Okay, I should probably fix that. <laughs> Where is a way that I can do both food and water? I don't want to eat the mute fruit. That's one of the things I want to keep. So, uh, what, do, what do I have that I can do both with? Uh, desert salad? Uh, that does a lot of the food. I don't necessarily want that much H2O fixed. Um, how about this? That's a lot more food than I need fixed. <laughs> but, uh, I guess that'll do. Because that also weighs a fuck ton. There we go. No hunger sickness. Yay! What the, huh? It became not enemies? In the last five seconds? How does that work? Um... Unless... Oh, wait. These guys killed him. These guys killed him dead. Wait a minute. There's another one over here. What is up with this guy? Oh! Oh! This is a legionary assassin, so they ran into them. And apparently didn't kill them outright. If this is any indication. So, let's see if we can get a couple shots in with this guy. Oh, we got one shot. In. And... Head crippled, at the very least. There we go, there's that. Come on now. Oh shit, come on. Okay, well he got it anyway. Okay, can I crouch? There we go. There we go. Okay, come on now. I don't want any one of my people to die and Eddie is like kinda on the front lines there. So I really don't want him to die. Because he, he, he is capable of dying. Okay. I'm getting good shots at the very least, but that's about it. There we go. There's that, at least. Where is he? Where'd the other guy go? Oh, the mercenary's stuck over there. Where is the other guy? Is he just shooting at him randomly? Gee, bus Lorenzo. Well, at least we got a couple of them down. Eddie, stop it! <laughs> He's running away! You don't need to fire at him anymore. Well, at least we got a couple rounds for the uh, brush gun. Or the medicine stick, rather. Uh, I'm going to take those. Uh, oh, I got, I got mace from this guy. That's nice. 
Uh, brush gun, I'll take that, because that could sell for a lot. Uh, plasma mine, that can sell for a lot. The pulse one's a little less so. Super sledge, holy shit. This guy was loaded. Holy shit. <laughs> I was loaded down with shit. Um, I'll take those, because those are always useful. Those are rounds I also just used. Um, submachine gun, that's a little broken down to be of any use selling. But, uh, I'll take the dirty water for sure. Take those, and, yeah, that's about it. Oh! Those can sell for a lot. I'll take those. Eddie, are you going to give up yet? Is he still running, or is he coming back? That's the question. Looks like he's still in range. Oh, there we go. Uh, head. That should do it. That should finish him off, anyway. And last bullet. There we go. Good stuff. Caesar's Legion Infamy gained, as if I didn't have the most already. Alright, I'll take these rounds. Assault car mine. That could sell for a bit. Um, purified water and a ripper. That would sell for a lot. That helmet or that armor. I don't really need either, so I'm going to leave them there. If I was using uh, medium armor, I would take them just so I could have the repair functionality from them. But no, that's not necessarily what I need right now. But, uh... Oh! Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, no! These people lost their Brahmin. Oh, wait, no! No, that's not Brahmin. That's mole rats! Okay, good! These guys made it without a scratch, really. Good shit. Wanted to see where they're at, but I can't... There they are. They made it without really a scratch. I mean, the mercenary was beat up quite a bit, but that's about it. Uh, where are my people? Can I get a look at them? I want to see Cass, Eddie. Yep, they're, they're healed up as far as I can go. That's good. That is good shit. Oh, wait. Do I have any stim packs on Cass? Fuck. I should, I should make sure. Let's um, distribute the weight. No, I don't. Shit. I need to get some more on her. Because that way she can actually heal herself in the middle of a fight. Uh, I have a lot, though. So I have no problem really giving that many to her. Uh... Maybe 80. That should do. That should do her for quite a while. I'm pretty sure stim packs wouldn't work on Eddie, though. Pretty sure. Could I... Is there a way to do that? Oh, apparently they would work on Eddie. Okay. Fuck me, then. I don't know nothing about anything. But, uh, yeah, there was another body. Uh, this guy. Assassin over here. So let's pick up what he had. Probably not a lot, considering I took him out rather quickly. Uh... Okay, there we go. There's all of that. Um, Marksman Carbine. That's also beat up quite a bit more than I thought it would be. So, uh, yeah, that we'll just leave all that stuff alone. There's Helios 1. Or at least I think that's Helios 1. I remember, right? Already been there, right? Would you let me do the thing? The Helios 1 is right over there, yeah. That's uh, controlled by the NCR, if I'm liked by them already. Alright, well, that was a little f bit of a fun distraction. More or less. Did not expect a uh, assassin group that close, but hey, I'm not going to complain. <laughs> that was actually kind of fun. I haven't done with, I haven't dealt with one of them in a long time. I was starting to think they forgot about me. All right, let's see what's in here. It's in this little spot. Nothing, nothing at all. Any of these. Must have been a little quarry area here at some point. But uh, it's long broken down now. That for damn sure. Okay. Should I go to Helios 1 or should I continue on in a northerly direction? Put it in the comments if I should be going in a northerly direction or towards Helios 1. I'll be choosing one or the other either way. Uh, what's, what's over here? That's what I want to know. Um, I think it's that one guy over here, isn't it? That one guy... What is that? Okay, those are trees. Okay, I was about to say, why isn't Eddie's uh, sensors picking those up already? Because they are trees. Okay. That's a... That has to be a lake bed. Or at least a uh, former lake bed. Okay, that's the... Uh, the Jack 1 million... The, I assume that's a jackpot 1 million. Big Ranch, Nevada State Lotto. Alrighty. 
Don't know why they had a bunch of women on the uh, thing there. Assume they were trying to market it to men. That is uh, unfortunate that they still do that in those that day and age. But then again, you know, it's pervasive forever, probably. Uh, let's see what we got here. Here, if I can actually do the things. Nope, nothing. And I hear gunshots. Don't know where they are. It's not like Fallout 4 where you can immediately follow all the gunshots going off. Sometimes it'll just be ambient noise and you have no idea where the fuck it is until you, you know, run right straight into it. <sighs> I should probably sleep. I don't have makeshift bedding over here. We should probably sleep. Now that I think about it. What, what am I sleep doing? Um, yeah, it's at 55. I should probably sleep. I should probably sleep a little bit. And then I'll eat in the morning. How's that sound, huh? How's that sound, people? I think it sounds good to me. So I'm going to do that, and then we'll uh, hear in the comments which direction we should go into Helios, or in a more northerly direction to explore a little bit more. Because I have not really gone that direction in a good long time. Um, Boulder City. I can run through there a little bit. It's been a while. Um, or I could go to Better Springs over here, which is light, so I guess it's under NCR control, which is weird because I thought Bitter Springs was a great con area. Maybe it got taken over. Anyway, I'll do my sleep in here, and I'll end the episode here for right now. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos, and you want to see more, and click the like button if you like this particular video. Share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the game for playing together, and which direction we're going to go next. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one the only Stray Cat playing games, and actually getting some good stuff done including killing some uh, legionnaire assassins for you.